Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing my top 10 favorite things about October. Now this isn't going to be in any particular order. I'm just going to go down a list and name y'all my favorite top 10 things about the fall. It was hard to list just 10 things, but these are going to be my 10 most favorite things that I could come up with. Number one, fall scents. I love all the fall scents that come out. I love the pumpkin smells and apple and cinnamon smells and leaves smells. There's just so many that smell good. I went out and bought a few fallish uh, wax melts for my wax melt warmer. And the Scentsy brand is my favorite, but, but there's quite a few that smell good that aren't Scentsy. I even bought some cheaper ones at Walmart and they smell really, really good too. And I love the candles, just anything fall scent. I start putting out all my fall scents in October and I just love all of those smells. Number two, pumpkins. Anything pumpkins. I like pumpkin decorations. I like seeing people that have carved pumpkins on their front porch. I especially like when they put like the candle in it and it's all lit up. I just love anything pumpkin. Again, pumpkin scents. Uh, but anything pumpkin, I just, I am obsessed. Number three, the weather change. I live in Mississippi and it stays warmer here longer than in a lot of states but it is already starting to get a little bit cooler, which cooler for us is going to be like in the upper 70s, low 80s. So, and that just recently started. So, and I wouldn't be surprised if it jumps right back up to the mid 80s next week, because in Mississippi, every day it's different. You might be freezing one day and sweating the next. So, but the weather does start to get cooler and I love cool weather. I actually like cold weather too. Most people don't, especially here in Mississippi, but. I like cold and I love when it starts to get cooler. Number four, the leaves changing. I love October because the leaves start changing here and turning all the fall pretty colors, the yellows and oranges. It's just so pretty. I love to see leaves all over the ground, even though you really need to rake them up so your grass doesn't completely die. But I love the leaves on the ground. I love to run and jump in them still. I think you should always be a big kid at heart. It's a way to stay youthful. Number five, our local fair. We have a local, well, it's really a statewide fair that comes every October. It's here the, the whole first two weeks of October. So it's going on right now. Uh, some years we go, some years we don't. The reason why we wouldn't go is we just have too much going on to really get by there. Um, but we did go last year. We went with my brother and his little girl. We had such a good time. I mostly go to eat. I walk around and eat tons. I think we spent a ton of money last year just on food. But my kids ride rides. I did get on one, but no, I rode two. I take that back. But I love the fair. It's so much fun. And every year the fair comes here, the weather gets cool for the two weeks it's here. Because it's just something about when the fair comes, you want it to be chilly. And so I always look forward to walking around the fair in the chilly weather. I love it. Number six, soup and chili. I start making soup and chili a lot starting in October. I mean, I do make soup and chili throughout the whole year. If I have a special craving, I'll make it, but I just don't make it very much. But once October gets here, all the way through the winter and until our cold weather is over with, I make soup a lot, I make chili a lot, and I look forward to that time of year because soup and chili is some of my favorite things to eat, and I really look forward to that. I wait all year just so that I can make soup and chili. Number seven, hot cocoa. I also start making hot chocolate about this time. As soon as the weather just starts to get a little bit cooler, I start making hot chocolate all the time in my favorite coffee mugs. I have tons of coffee mugs because I do collect them. And I love the big, cute, deep coffee mugs. A lot of people don't like the real big ones. I love them and I love to fill them up with hot chocolate with some whipped cream or marshmallows, maybe some of both. And yeah, I just love hot chocolate. I wait all year for this time of the year just so that I can drink a ton of hot chocolate. Number eight, time to bring out the boots. I look forward to this time of year for my boots. I love boots. I'm a boot person. I have only a couple of pair that are still wearable. Um, in fact, they both still look great because I do try to take care of my boots, my shoes and everything. So they last me a long time. But any of the other boots that I had, I've had for so long, they're just completely worn out. So I have two really cute pair of boots, two completely different style of boots. I want to get me at least one more 
for this fall and winter, but I love wearing boots with some leggings or some jeans um, or even a cute dress. I just love boots. Again, I wait all year to wear the boots because I love my boots. They are so cute and so comfortable. Number nine, scary movies. I love scary movies. I'm a scary movie fanatic. Me and my husband have seen every scary movie there is known to man, except maybe for a couple, but we, yeah, we've watched every single one. I love them all. Corny ones, realistic ones, any kind. I love scary movies. We watch them in October all month. We may watch, you know, two a week, three a week. We at least try to get one in a week. I just love scary movies so much. Even though they do scare me, I do get scared, but that's the fun of it for me. I love to get scared and I love scary movies so much. And the last favorite thing about October is Halloween. I love Halloween so much. It's one of my favorite holidays. A lot of people don't really celebrate Halloween or they don't consider it a holiday per se, but I love Halloween so much. My kids go trick-or-treating every year. Now, Isaac is 12, and he was asking me the other day, am I too old to trick-or-treat? Because some people have their opinions about this. Now, when I was his age, I still went trick-or-treating. I feel like all the way through middle school, you're good. Now, I will admit, I went trick-or-treating in high school with my best friend. We went trick-or-treating. I don't think I went like as a senior or anything, but I did go through high school. But I do I do think though now that I'm a parent that once you're getting into the high school years, you might be getting a little too old for Halloween. But I mean, they're still kids too. They're just bigger kids. You cannot beat free candy. It's so the one day of the year you can go trick or treating to the last houses, turn their light off and get as much candy as you want for free. I love my sweets. I love candy. I'm a junk food junkie. My kids love candy. And even though I'm not the one actually having to go door to door, you know, I just walk with them and let them go up to the door by themselves. And then when they're getting tired, I get in the car and drive them from house to house. But I feel like if it wasn't for me, they would be able to go trick or treating because I wouldn't be allowing them to go on their own. I'm the one walking with them and then I'm the one getting in my car, driving them as long as they want to go. And so I end up choosing a big chunk of candy for myself out of each of their bags. So, because <laughs> I feel like I put forth a lot of work too. Like I said, if it wasn't for me, they wouldn't be able to go. So I ended up swiping a lot of their candy. And so that's why I want them to get even more free candy so that I can get a ton. So yes, I love it. And some years I dress up, some years I don't, but I do love to dress up. I think it's fun. I may possibly do that this year. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure if I do. I kind of thought I want to be a ghost and I'm talking about the new modern ghost costumes they have. I'm talking about the old school white sheet with the holes in it. You know, I mean, take it back old school ghost. Call me Casper. Yeah, I, I do kind of want to dress up this year, but yeah, Halloween is one of my favorite holidays. I get into it. I bet October passes way too quick. I get all into the excitement and the anticipation of waiting for Halloween to come and then before I know it, it's over with. But I love Halloween, so that would probably be one of my definite favorites of October. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would love to hear some of y'all's favorite things about October. You can just leave them in the comments below. Let me know if some of the things I named are your favorites as well. And tell me what some of y'all's favorite things about October is, because I would love to hear them. And yes, I will just talk to y'all in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.